Interpersonal skills play a pivotal role in fostering effective communication and building robust relationships in a professional environment. These are the tools we use daily to interact and communicate with others, encompassing everything from communication and listening skills to attitude and deportment. They're vital for forging connections, communicating effectively, and achieving shared goals. And the great news, they're not innate traits. They can be learned and honed over time, bringing about significant benefits in both your personal and professional life. So, are you ready for a transformative journey? Let's dive into seven smart ways to enhance your interpersonal skills at work. Before we go any further, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. The first step in improving interpersonal skills is effective communication. To convey your ideas clearly and respectfully, it's essential to focus not just on what you're saying, but how you're saying it. This involves being mindful of your tone, body language, and the words you choose. Studies have shown that effective communication is more than just an interpersonal skill. It can significantly boost productivity and enhance team relationships. A study published in Business Communication Quarterly in 2017 found that teams with strong communication practices were more productive and experienced less conflict. So how can we become better communicators? It starts with understanding. Understand your audience, their perspectives, and their needs. Tailor your message to suit these needs and ensure it's clear, concise, and respectful. Also consider the timing and the medium of your message. Is it an urgent matter that requires an immediate response or can it wait for the next team meeting? Should you send an email or would a face-to-face -face conversation be more appropriate? Making these decisions wisely can improve the effectiveness of your communication. Lastly, don't forget to ask for feedback. This will help you gauge if your message was understood as you intended and provides an opportunity for clarification if needed. Remember, clear communication is the cornerstone of a healthy work environment. Active listening is another crucial element of interpersonal skills. This isn't just about hearing words spoken to you. It's about truly understanding the speaker's perspective, their context, their emotions. It's about paying attention, showing that you're engaged, and providing feedback to ensure clarity. It's a skill that takes practice, but its impact is significant. According to a study published in the International Journal of Listening in 2019, active listening has been found to significantly improve work relationships. It builds trust, fosters understanding, and paves the way for productive collaboration. But remember, active listening isn't just a passive process. It involves asking questions, paraphrasing to confirm understanding, and showing empathy towards the speaker's point of view. This approach not only enhances your communication skills, but also helps in creating a more positive and collaborative work environment. So make an effort to listen, not just hear. Scene script, empathy, the ability to understand and share the feelings of others is a vital interpersonal skill. It's more than just being sympathetic. It's about truly comprehending what someone else is experiencing. Whether it's a colleague dealing with a personal issue or a team member struggling with a challenging project, showing empathy can create a supportive and understanding work environment. Research supports this. A study published in the Journal of Occupational Health Psychology in 2016 demonstrated that empathy can significantly reduce workplace stress and conflict. When colleagues feel understood and supported, they're less likely to experience stress leading to fewer conflicts and a more productive environment. But how do we cultivate empathy? It starts with active listening. When a colleague shares their concerns or struggles, don't just hear their words, try to understand their feelings. Ask questions to gain a deeper understanding and most importantly, validate their feelings. This doesn't mean you have to agree with them, but acknowledging their feelings can go a long way in building empathy. In short, putting yourself in others' shoes can create a more harmonious workplace. Trust building is a critical component of interpersonal skills. It's the invisible thread that weaves together professional relationships, transforming them from mere work interactions into a strong interconnected network. Now let's see how trust impacts team performance. A study published in the Journal of Applied Psychology in 2017 revealed that trust significantly enhances team collaboration and productivity. It's like a domino effect. When trust is established, 
communication flourishes. With open and honest communication comes increased understanding and collaboration. And when a team collaborates effectively, productivity naturally soars. But how do we build this trust? It starts with consistency, be reliable, deliver on your promises. It also involves transparency. When mistakes are made, own up to them. Trust is also fostered through empathy and understanding, which we discussed earlier. Trust building is not a one-time event, it's a continuous process, a journey. Each interaction, each decision, each conversation can either build or break trust. And it's this trust that forms the bedrock of successful teams. Remember, trust is the glue that holds teams together. Mutual respect is the foundation of a healthy work environment. It's the golden rule of life that applies just as much to the office as it does to the playground. When we respect our colleagues, we recognize their value and acknowledge their contributions. This doesn't mean we always have to agree, but it does mean we have to be fair and considerate in our interactions. Research published in the Journal of Organizational Behavior in 2018 found that respect in the workplace can significantly reduce conflicts and increase job satisfaction. This makes sense, right? When we feel respected, we're more likely to feel satisfied with our jobs and less likely to engage in unnecessary conflicts. But here's the kicker, respect is a two-way street. It's not just about how others treat us, but also how we treat them. We need to show respect to earn respect. This involves recognizing others' hard work, listening to their ideas, and valuing their opinions. It means treating everyone, regardless of their role or seniority, with the same level of decency and fairness. So treat others as you wish to be treated. Improving interpersonal skills can be a game changer for your professional life. We've explored some powerful strategies for strengthening these skills, from effective communication and active listening to empathy, trust building and mutual respect. Remember, these aren't just one-time actions, but habits to cultivate and embed into your daily interactions. Effective communication is about expressing your ideas and needs clearly and respectfully. Active listening, on the other hand, is about truly understanding what others are saying, not just hearing the words. Empathy is about putting yourself in another's shoes to comprehend their feelings and perspectives. Trust building is crucial in any relationship. It's about proving you're reliable and keeping your promises. Mutual respect, the bedrock of any healthy interaction, is about recognizing and valuing the worth of everyone around you. But let's not forget that learning is a lifelong journey. We never really stop learning, do we? The beauty of interpersonal skills is that they can always be honed and improved. With continuous effort, we can transform our work environments and personal lives, promoting positivity and connection. For those of you on a fitness journey, we've got a special tool to help you stay on track. Check out the calorie and protein calculator in the description below. It's a fantastic way to kickstart your fitness journey and keep track of your progress. If you found this video useful, please leave a comment below. Your feedback helps us create content that best serves your needs. And before you go, thank you so much for watching our video and please make sure to subscribe to our channel. If you want to try our 90 day dopamine detox challenge, watch the video on your screen next. Thank you for watching.